welcome back. It's Eve. Today I'm going to attempt something that I'm not really looking forward to just because covering your face in gloss. Oh, it just sounds so sticky. Anyway, <laughs> I feel every year, every couple months, there's like a new face of something and so far I haven't seen a full face of gloss. So I thought, hey, why not? <laughs> I like the aesthetic of gloss. But wearing it, it's just, I guess I haven't come across like a good gloss that I like. They've always just been, you know, globs of like stickiness to me. But the look of it's really cool. Like I, I've seen glossy eyes. Those look oh, so high fashion. And glossy lips are super pretty. And that's kind of it. That's where it stops. But I don't know. I feel like everyone's into that almost wet look with all the highlighters. This could be the next thing. Like gloss highlighters, right? <laughs> Imagine the gloss, gloss highlighters. Let's just get started. Okay, so the rules are your whole face has to have gloss. So you can mix pigments or like eyeshadows to create colors if you'd like, or you can buy lip gloss that has that color. I mean, in case there needs to be rules, you know? I'm going to be taking really the mixing pigments with gloss kind of route. So my foundation is going to be this NYX Butter Gloss in the color Fortune Cookie. That's like, what a cute name. Hold on. Can y'all see that? It's hard to color match um, in general for me. So <laughs> trying to color match my skin. Oh my god. Ew. Trying to color match my skin with a gloss. Kind of impossible. This is too pink for me, probably. <laughs> I'm more of a yellow tone based. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh. This is going to take forever. I just little wand in my whole face. Regrets already. Look how pink... I'm pink. Okay. <laughs> smells really good though. This feels horrible. <laughs> is this gonna clog up my pores? <laughs> oh my god. Oh, wow, that looks good though on the, <laughs> on the camera. Let's just get it on and then I'll blend it out with my finger. <laughs> Bring some on the neck. Can't forget that. <laughs> it feels exactly how you would think plenty now i guess mm, 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 a look seriously you don't even need highlighter though because like your whole face <laughs> so foundation's done mm, feeling myself <sighs> looking good smelling good next i'm going to do contour i'm just going to go the pigment and mix kind of way. I'm mixing what I usually use for contour, which is the NYX High Definition Blush in Taupe. And I'm going to take some plain lip gloss. This one is from Maybelline. Maybe it's Maybelline. I'm just going to be shaving off a little bit with my tweezers. It has been mixed, so let's uh, contour my face, I guess. <laughs> wow, does that look good? <laughs> I mean, it kind of blends because it's wet, right? It's like a seamless blend. <laughs> Is it? I don't know. I think it's impossible to do, honestly, like a really good look with this challenge. The first part already screws you up. <laughs> right, can't forget that nose. Oh gosh. Ugh. Temples. I want to die. This feels... <sighs> Why did I do this? I feel like... <gasps> Have you guys seen that, um, I think it's a vine or something. My friend showed me and I've been obsessed ever since. It's this baby who's literally covered in peanut butter <laughs> and he's eating out of a peanut butter jar and his mom comes and is like, do you like the peanut butter? And the baby turns around and he's like, ah. <laughs> I feel like, oh, I feel like, um, oh, <laughs> help me. Oh, yes. Yeah. Contouring is done. I did my chin. I did all the points. Now I'm going to do concealer, I guess. Like concealer and a highlight, but not like a shine highlight. Does that make sense? I'm gonna just take this like yellowy light color from a palette that you can't buy anymore. So there's no point really in me uh, telling you guys. All right, it's been mixed up too. Oh gosh. So you put concealer underneath your eye. Mm. Does that even make a difference? Oh. Yeah. All right, let's cut those cheekbones <laughs> and cut the other one. Oh, pressure on the nose. Oh, chin. <laughs> oh. <laughs> mm. Mm. What 
much. Like, it's gonna look so bad. Okay, zero to 100 right now. <laughs> yes. Oh, oh, you see the contour. <laughs> Next, what do you do? Uh, <laughs> I guess I could do my eyes. I don't have an like an actual eye gloss item or like an official eye gloss, I guess. But I hear, I mean, it seems like you just mix same thing. You can mix a pigment and then you can actually probably brush on your look and then lay a gloss over it or mix in the color with a gloss. So that's what I'm gonna keep doing. When I see like an actual real, <laughs> A uh, glossy eye. I think that it's, it it kind of gives me like this grungy vibe. So I'm gonna do like the grungy red and brown eye. I'm gonna mix some orange, and that's gonna be my transition color. Oh my gosh, my heart hurts. Ugh, it's like stabbing into your eyeshadows. Ugh, breaks my heart. Okay, so that, that's a really deep transition color. <laughs> the gloss really brought out the pigment in it. So maybe that's it's gonna be like my all over color. Oh my god. It's, oh, by the way, let me tell you, it's Jam from the Venus 2 palette, that orange color. Wow, I can't even show it, the orange color. Oh my god. Oh, oh. <laughs> it's getting everywhere. No. How, how do you even apply a gloss eye? It, do you do it with brushes? Am I doing this all wrong? <laughs> What's the procedure? Okay, so we're doing the whole eye. Cute, cute. Oh my gosh, this is impossible. How do you apply a glossy eye? Maybe I should have looked up tutorials before. This end is not cooperating. Oh my god. I'm gonna get a Q-tip. I think that's gonna help me out. Back with a Q-chip. <laughs> with a Q-chip. With a Q-tip. And let's see if this will help me out. Well, anything can help me out right now. Uh, mm, no, not really. It's not helping. <laughs> I thought I was a genius for a second. Oh my god. Okay, let's just bring it under too. Why not? So I'm just trying to clean it up right now. I mean, the best that I think I can to blend out, <laughs> blend out this. I don't even know what's happening on my eye, to be honest. <laughs> I'm just going to take plain gloss and use that. Maybe it'll fade it out. I see why no one's done this. Or if they have attempted it, I see why they haven't like actually put it up for the world to see because this is a hot mess, let me tell you. Okay, let's just not get this really complicated because that took a year. I'm going to now deepen up the eye with mud. All right, mixed it. And now, oh, let's pray. Let's do a fade from brown into the orange. And then I'm trying to bring the orange back out because I just destroyed it. <laughs> this looks like literally terrible. There's no way to save this. At all. I thought if anything I should get the gloss eye like okay because that's an actual thing. Okay, I'm gonna sadly try and do my other eye and I'll be back. Alright guys, <laughs> I spent like a good half an hour on both eyes. I don't even know why I tried to spend that much time on it because it doesn't look any better so brace yourselves. <laughs> I thought I'd try and do like a cool graphic eye with <laughs> wasn't working I mean wow carrot realness so next we're gonna do some highlight Ooh. and I'm just gonna take this mega shine lip gloss from NYX in the color beige pearl and it had like pretty glitter in it or it was like kind of a metallic gloss and honestly with all the shine I don't even know why I try to buy like <laughs> a gloss that can highlight because my whole face is as lit up as it can be so yeah, there's a little shine. It's not too much. It's a very like kind of dewy look. Ah! Okay, next let's do our eyebrows. So I'm going to use this color icon, which is a very dark brown. And I'm going to mix it in as well. Maybe take a spoolie brush and coat it and then go through my eyebrows. Anyway, there's no point in trying to look good anymore because it's not gonna happen. Oh my god, no. <laughs> What's happening? This is impossible. This is impossible. I never went in thinking with intention that it's gonna look amazing, but god, this is like way worse. 
Let's match your sister. Wow, very, very full looking. <laughs> I'm just gonna use this for my mascara too because people use brown mascara. That's done. And I guess finally all we have to do is just our lips. I'm gonna keep that orange that I have, but also I'm gonna mix in a little bit of red. This one is Muse from the Venus One palette. This is the only part I know that I can't screw up. Oh, the mascara. <laughs> Oh my gosh, the no, the mascara. <laughs> so the lips came out. Oh, I love that color. Oh, if that was a real color, I would, I would, I mean, it's a real color, but someone needs to make this color because this one's banging. This is, oh, the look. Should I set it? Let's keep it. It needs to stay in place all day. And let's add to the wetness. So slow mo. Honestly, this feels like it could possibly be like a really high-end photo shoot look because <laughs> sometimes they make like, I don't know, right? Like, or is that just in my head where it just looks like a crazy mess and I'm trying to back it up by saying that it's really artistic looking? <laughs> oh, it keeps getting better. I hope you guys enjoyed this look and my face, I really, I just want to tear it off. It's, oh my god. Oh my god, so sorry. <laughs> I love it. I need to, yeah, I'm really, I'm gonna take, I'm gonna, I don't know, I'm just gonna burn off my face and I'll see you guys next time. Pray for my skin because I don't know what this has done. It's been on my face for a while. Okay, enough talking. Bye! Oh, turn off.